Hi, welcome to another episode of David Rides a Trike. I'm David, I'm riding a trike. Hello. Hi. What you doing? I'm filming a video here, can't you see? You're shooting a video? Oh, okay. Here? It, it, that's enough. Hi. All right, sorry about that, rude intruders. So, I'm David, I'm riding a trike. I try to provide a little motivation to people with chronic illnesses and disabilities to find some fun form of exercise, to get outside, ride a bike, walk, run, whatever it is for you. For me, it's riding this recumbent trike. Personally, I am both chronically ill and disabled to some extent. I have had three organ transplants, including a pancreas transplant that cured me of type 1 diabetes that was discovered when I was only a year and a half old. I just celebrated the 24th anniversary of that transplant. It happened when I was 41. I am no longer a diabetic. I've had two other organ transplants. I've had stage three cancer. I'm legally blind. I just finished radiation treatments today for some nasty skin cancer and a whole bunch of other things. But today, you're in for a special treat. People have been clamoring, yes, clamoring, to find out what's in my bag. And today, you're going to find out. Remember when you used to have a bag on the back of your bike when you were a kid? And we called it a saddle bag. Not quite sure what this bag is called. Anyway, let's see. First, my phone. And as you can see, I keep it in a dust-proof case. This trail, especially now, we're going through a really bad drought and uh, the trail is extremely dusty and everything in here gets absolutely coated. Then I have another little dustproof bag. In here I keep my ear pods, which I uh, sometimes will wear one if I'm expecting a, a, an important call. I don't like to put them in both ears, but I put it in one ear and set it so that I can hear the ambient noise around me. Also in here, something that's critical to me is a little magnifying glass. With my vision, it's really hard for me to see a lot of things on my phone or on the camera. So I always carry a magnifying glass with me. And last is just the garage door opener so I could get back in when I get home. Next, GoPro Max. This is the camera I use to shoot the video that looks like someone else is shooting it or like it's shot from a drone. It's all shot from this little camera and it's held out on what they call an invisible selfie stick. It's a, an extendable selfie stick that gets automatically removed by the software in the camera. Actually, pretty cool that it could do that. Next, these white bags are dust-proof bags. Um, again, very important out here. Right now, it's just holding the case for my DJI Pocket 2, which is the camera I'm actually shooting this video with right now. So, right now I only have the case in there. Usually I have the camera in it as well. Another dustproof case. This is what I use to hang on. And in here, this dustproof bag, not case, they're bags, is my Sony RX100 Mark 7. 
I started out doing my videos, didn't start out, but pretty early on, I started using this camera to shoot my videos and it did a great job. The problem was I had to hold it out on a selfie stick so that it was far enough back and it got really heavy really fast at the end of that stick and I ran into trouble just supporting it. Um, I take it with me now because it takes great still photos. So this is what I use for all my still, still pictures. Oh, let's see. It's amazing how much stuff you could stuff into this little bag. Okay. This is another dust-proof bag. And in it, I carry, you know, this side bag is stuff that I always want to be able to grab without getting up and going around to the back uh case on my on the rack so if I want to get grab a camera or camera related items it all goes in here so this is another dustproof bag and in no particular order this is the case for the mic system that I'm wearing the Rode wireless go is what it's called it lives in here as does my keys with, yes, another magnifying glass. And what other goodies? Glasses case. Currently, it's holding my regular glasses and I just switch the case back and forth between my sunglasses and my regular glasses, obviously as needed. Half of an energy bar. Remote control. This is a remote control for the Sony camera so that if I want to put the camera on a tripod, take a picture of myself over here or something like that, I could use this and it's got a trigger mechanism. This is a um, both a wide angle as well as a macro lens for the Sony camera. Using it just like this, it's wide angle, but it unscrews and if I put just this part on it works as a macro lens for the camera so kind of cool a little two-in-one lens and right now I'm really at the capacity for this side bag as to what it can hold. My new trike that's on order, I am going to get a bar that attaches to the back of the seat so that I could hold bags on each side because I just keep accumulating more and more junk. Finally in this bag, well, not finally, I have a spare battery for the Sony camera. The DJI camera doesn't have a removable battery so there's no spear and this is just lens tissue for cleaning the lenses on various cameras all right let me dump all this stuff back in here quickly okay ah Fig Newtons, always good to have some with you. Sunblock, very critical. Well, it's critical for everybody, especially for me um, with my history of skin cancer. I also have a few 
uh, Purell wipes. And finally, one of my dog Franny's poop bags. Why do I carry this, you ask? In case it starts raining, I could throw my cameras and other sensitive electronic stuff into here. So, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> that is about it. That's what I carry in my side bag. Now you know you can sleep much more easily at night knowing exactly what's in here at all times when I go for a ride. Hope you enjoyed this video. I will see you on the next ride. Please subscribe, comment, and give it a thumbs up down below. Like I said, see you on the next ride. Bye-bye.